Hare Krishna, welcome to Hare Krishna News. Our news for the day is Shishi Radha Krishna installation and temple opening in Malaysia. In 1980, ISKCON was officially a registered organization in Malaysia. By 2001, ISKCON Malaysia has purchased a land of 10 acres bordering Kuala Lumpur and a 17,000 square feet land and building in the city. Around the country, the society was operated about 24 preaching centers, some were purchased and some on rental. By this time, ISKCON had already been established wherever Srila Prabhupada has set his feet and these preaching centers were operating in their own properties except for the centers in Penang. It is hard to predict how the mercy of the spiritual master works. Last but not the least, in God Purnima 2001, the unwilling mercy of Srila Prabhupada was showered on the Penang state. Serving at the heart of the town planning office of the Penang Development Corporation, His Grace Kalesha Dasa highlighted to ISKCON leaders the availability of an acre of land amidst a religious enclave at the new Sibirang Jaya Township. ISKCON made no mistake and with all proper formalities secured this God-given land. More of Srila Prabhupada's mercy of the Malaysian Yatra will be spoken at the temple opening on 29th August 2015. Malaysian history is certainly related to Mahabharata Ramayan and the history of Bharata Bhumi. No wonder the many ISKCON devotees who visited Malaysia said that Malaysia is the hidden jewel. You just need to make it to the temple opening to know more about Malaysia, the hidden jewel of Krishna consciousness. The hidden jewel, this history, Srila Prabhupada's instruction and desire for Malaysia preaching will also be explained and exhibited at the Srila Prabhupada Gallery. The gallery is an innovation by the temple youth. The Sri Sri Radha Krishna Temple of Devotion and Understanding is scheduled to open on Balram Purnima, August 29th this year. The address is as follow. The co-zonal secretary of ISKCON Malaysia, His Holiness Jayapataka Swami and Banu Swami and the president of ISKCON Malaysia, His Holiness Bhakti Vrajendra Nandan Swami will preside over the installation ceremony. His Holiness Bhakti Vigna Vinashak Narsam Haswami, Jayanand Goswami Maharaj, Ramai Swami, Bhakti Madhurya Govinda Swami, Bhakti Vinod Swami, Bhakti Nityanand Swami, Bhakti Purushottam Swami, and His Grace Deena Bandhu Prabhu have also confirmed their attendance. The Mayapur Gurkul priest, together with Mayapur Chandras from ISKCON World Headquarters at Sridham Mayapur, will be performing the fire sacrifice, installation ceremony, and kirtan respectively. On the 30th of August, will be a national Abhishek for Srila Prabhupada to warm up the 50th anniversary celebration of ISKCON in July 2016. There will be an initiation ceremony followed with the opening of Srila Prabhupada Gallery. While a detailed program schedule will be posted later, here is the main schedule. You can start making plans and book your accommodation with the hotels. Code reference is Hare Krishna Temple to get these rates. They have also organized shuttle service from temple to hotels for your convenience. This ends our news for the day. For more news, keep watching Hare Krishna News. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel Iskon Desire Tree for more spiritual videos. Thank you very much. 
Hare Krishna.